Welcome back, everyone. Sean Stevens here again with Metroplex Mortgage Services and another USDA Loan Pro video quick tip. How do you qualify for a USDA loan with a property located in a flood zone? For anyone who has had this situation come up before, USDA guidelines have implemented a key change that will make a significant impact when moving forward on existing properties located in flood zones. Today's video tip will cover the details which you need to know to keep buyers, sellers, and realtors in the know when USDA financing is involved with a property in a flood zone. But before we get started, don't forget to download our USDA Blueprint for Success with a link below. This free guide breaks down the USDA process step by step. So don't be scared, be aware. So can you qualify for a USDA loan when a property is in a flood zone? As a quick review, prior to December 1st, 2014, USDA guidelines previously required the following when a property was located in a special flood hazard area. A flood elevation certification is also required to ensure the first floor of habitable space, including basements and mechanicals located in crawl spaces, is above the 100-year flood zone elevation. At best, this could be a tedious process, and at worst, even if flood insurance was available, being able to move forward was contingent on receiving an acceptable flood elevation certificate as mentioned. Now, we can see another positive change under the updated USDA 3555 regulations, which modernize their flood insurance guidelines and simply require that existing dwellings are eligible if flood insurance is available for the community through FEMA's National Flood Insurance Program, or a policy under the Write Your Own Program, or private flood insurance as approved by the lender. Assuming the home buyer is able to purchase acceptable flood insurance, the need for the additional step requiring the calculation for base flood elevation is no longer needed for existing properties. However, obtaining an acceptable flood elevation certificate is still the requirement for new construction properties. If you do have questions on how to qualify for a USDA loan on a new construction property, we hold a high level of experience on these transactions, so please call my team to discuss your questions today. It is important to not let the details overwhelm you, but instead take away the positive change, which now simply require the need for the home buyer to obtain acceptable flood insurance on the property, much like other programs. Remember, not all lenders have experience with processing and closing USDA loans. As an approved USDA lender, we are known for our program expertise and have specific systems in place to process USDA loans from pre-qualification to closing. Just call or email if you have any USDA qualifying questions, want to discuss a new scenario, or would just like to take advantage of our free second opinion service, which is great for those existing transactions. I want everyone to make it a great day and look forward to seeing you right here for the next tip of the week.